Jethro, the beloved Cornish comedian, has left a fortune of more than three pounds. Three million in his will following his death last year. The comic legend died aged 73 shortly before Christmas on December 14 in Devon and was later laid to rest in January under a black and white St. Perron's flag, the official flag of his beloved county of Cornwall. Following his death last December, it has now been revealed that Jethro left the bulk of his estate to his long-term partner Jenny Barabal. He left a bequest of £20,000 worth of premium bonds to be shared equally between his three grandchildren, and the rest of his estate to his sons Jesse and Lanyon Rowe. Real name Jeffrey Rowe, the funny man from St. Berrien was a comedian who had earned fame and adoration after spending more than 50 years traveling performing live shows. He rose to prominence in the 1980s making his debut TV appearance in 1990 when he featured on The Day O'Connor Show. From there he went on to perform many shows both on the stage and on TV. The comic passed away from COVID-19, his family announced last December and it is understood he had been fully vaccinated and had received his booster jab. He had previously battled Hodgkin lymphoma but had recovered, according to his manager John Miles. Speaking of Jethro's death, he said, they did all they could do, it was just so aggressive and fast. He was a lovely guy, a very kind guy and very funny. At least he brought a lot of enjoyment to many people. An official statement announcing Jethro's death said, It is with tremendous sadness that we announce the passing of the well-known and popular Cornish comedian Jethro. Tragically Jethro passed away on December 14, 2021 after contracting COVID-19. Jethro leaves behind his life partner Jenny, sons Jesse and Lanyon, stepdaughter Sarah, daughter-in-law Stacy and of course his much-loved grandchildren. The comedian's grieving family asked for donations go to the Children's Hospice Southwest after his death. St. Austell-based Little Harbor Hospice's Sarah Stott, said, We were really touched that they would be thinking of us at this difficult time. It meant so much and we send our heartfelt thanks to them. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at webcelebs at trinitamirror.com or call us direct 0207 29